In this video, we present our explorations of the benefits and mechanisms of enabling intuitive by manual input to a multi-touch system. A key consideration in the design of our prototype has been to provide intuitive input mappings as well as providing clear means to enable real-time learning of more advanced functionality. By using a pen and touch combination on a coincident display and control surface, users are able to perform tasks more efficiently and with a more intuitive understanding of the tools as compared to only touch or pen based setups. In a formal experiment, our participants not only completed a representative task faster while using pen and touch input, but also committed fewer errors. Especially for bimanual tasks, which require high precision and frequent mode switches, this technique provides a speed and accuracy benefit over two handed touch or using two pens. In addition, using the pen in a dominant hand for high precision tasks while using touch input with a non dominant hand for coarser tasks allows for an excellent mapping to real world use as reported in previous work. Based on these principles, we implemented the prototype which wraps the common graphics application to show new concepts for pen and touch by manual interaction. Using the pen in a dominant hand allows sketching like on a graphics tablet. The non-dominant hand supports the actions of the dominant hand. The two-finger stretching and squeezing gesture zooms in and out. Touching with multiple fingers pans the drawing area. Simple postures with the non-dominant hand can be used to mode the pen's functionality. In this example, we constrain the drawing to straight lines. A key problem with multi-touch interfaces is the need for users to learn complex gestures and postures. In order to move beyond the basic gestures we have already described, our system includes a feedback panel at the top of the display. This panel reveals two levels of information, the mechanism and outcome of invocation. The mechanism can either be touch or pen based, or supported inputs are always shown. Here we see the available inputs, pen, whole hand, multi-finger touch, two-finger touch, and single-finger touch. A single-finger touch reveals a menu. The menu can be invoked or dragged to any location on the surface. Selections from the menu are performed with a second finger that either taps or strokes over a button. If actions require additional information about the position of invocation, the same tooltip from the feedback panel will be shown as balloon at the appropriate location. The color picker features parallel by manual interaction for selecting the stroke color. While the pen with its highly precise input is used for defining the hue value, one finger touch can set the more coarse saturation and value component. Two finger touch drags the color picker. The brush size can be changed with a two-finger gesture of the non-dominant hand. Tapping on the back side of the menu performs one step of undo. An undo menu shortly appears to inform about that action. Holding that two-finger posture keeps the undo menu visible. Now the pen can be used to specify the number of undo steps. Rectangle selections can be performed in two different ways, single point stretching or two points simultaneously. For the single point selection, the rectangle button is clicked with one finger. Like with a mouse control, the pen defines one corner and stretches the rectangle region. The alternative two point selection is initialized with one finger touching the position of a corner. The pen selects the rectangle button and the directional rectangle selection corner is assigned to it. For polygon selections, the precise pen sets the position of the corners that are confirmed with one finger tap of the other hand. Free selections can be drawn with the pen. Once a selection is made, it can be copied. To copy, two fingers touch into the selected region and drag the area. Alternatively, the area can be cut. To accomplish this, one finger touches into the selected region and drags the area. Cut or copied regions can be coarsely placed by dragging with the non-dominant hand that performed the cut or copy action. For higher precision, 
the pen can be coupled and define pixel accurate offsets to the current position. Our system represents an application of our design framework for by manual task assignment, providing validation through the construction of a tool for real-world use.